Okay, so this is cool. I'm Mary Davis, along with my in-studio guest, Stephen McQueen. <laughs> yes, yes. How you doing? Nice to see you today. Thanks for coming by. It's good to be here. Nice warm day outside. Got to roll into the office here. Okay, so let's back it up for a second. You are Stephen Steve McQueen's grandson. Yes. What's that like, growing up in the shadow of one of the biggest movie stars of all time, maybe? Well, you know, he, he passed away in uh, 1980, and I was born in 88, so unfortunately I never got to meet him. Uh, but watching all his movies and stuff kind of, you know, definitely helped inspire certain dreams of mine and, um, and um, you know, put a little competitive spirit, I feel, in me that I wanted to kind of do different roles than he would and kind of march my own path so I can pull my way out of that shadow. Interesting. Competitive. So you want to do better or more? Uh, I mean, I, I mean, not so much better, but just kind of have a, my path that I walk. You okay. Know? And, um, you know, I kind of played sports growing up, too, so I, I've always had that competitive nature where I'm like, I'm going to pull my way out of that shadow and make a shadow of my own. Okay, well, you know, because that's a thing, you know, that's a tough thing. You know, oh, certain yeah, people course. like, you know, maybe different with like Bob Dylan or Jacob Dylan, you know, you want Yeah, yeah, actually. But, but at the same time, you're still under this umbrella of this huge, huge icon. Oh, yeah, of course, which is, you know, it's great. It, it definitely presents great opportunities and stuff. But, you know, that competitive nature in me sparks up and I'm going to take over. Okay. <laughs> Do you think that helped you breaking into Hollywood? I think it definitely opened certain doors, um, you know, uh, because you could have changed just, your name to, like, you know, Joseph Goldberg. <laughs> I could have. I could have done that. I figured, you know, the name I was born with was, you know, the name I was going to stick with, though. And, uh, you know, I, my mom got remarried, so I kind of added the R on, on film credits, Stephen R. McQueen, uh, out of respect for him, okay. my stepdad. And, uh, you know, I just figured it was my name. So Okay. Sticking Let's talk about the movie. Because right. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie, I haven't seen the movie, but I watched the trailer. Uh, yeah. And this looks like... It, it, it's an awesome thrill ride, I bet. Oh yeah, I mean it, it's a blast. You know, it's 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 going back to the old scary movies where you know you can't you laugh at certain points, and, right? And you scream at others. And Alex Aja, our director, um, is used to intense horror at all times. You know, it's fast paced, and for him, he was like a kid in a playground when he got to add a new element to it, uh, a new level of humor to it, you know, kind of almost make fun of the situation, but also <laughs> fear it. Uh, it's good, and it, we came up with this great end product that ended up being like somewhere in between Jaws and and Snakes on a Plane. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that makes me want to run out and see it oh, immediately. I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean, it's it's fun, man. It's just it's a good time. It was funny too being at Comic Con because I was there for the show and 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 for for Piranha 3D and you know it's just complete different audiences. Vampire Diaries is very much teenage girls and stuff like that and 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 then you go to Prana where it's like an older cult following uh a bunch of nerdy guys you no, can no, say no, it no i mean because i'm i'm looking i'm wearing a batman shirt right now i'm not exactly <laughs> cool like <laughs> well, um, uh, wait, let's but just, it just just it was cool to be able to see the different groups that were able to entertain with different projects okay okay now you 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 get back to vampire diaries which yeah. is shot here in atlanta which is really cool so you're living here part-time or full-time Oh, I live here full time now. Me, Great. me, my dog, and my car just drove the, drove on up from LA over Fourth of July. Um, Are you and, single? Uh, I, I'm newly single, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm a little heartbroken. And right seriously, now. how many chicks do you get? Look at you. You're an actor. You're good looking. You're Steve McQueen's grandson. I don't think you're having any problems in the in the lady department. Uh, are you trying to get my number right now? No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, believe me, I just think someone like you, Check you're me. at the time of your life. This is like, you're, I mean, this is your day in the sun, Stephen. <laughs> you know, uh, I, I take the work serious when I'm working, and when I'm not, I, 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 enjoy, I enjoy my life. I was going to sure. say, if I were you, like, if I could be, like, in your, I would just be, do it. I yeah, just, I mean, of course. <laughs> I, yeah. I think you're, you're just like in the prime. That's so fantastic. Yeah, you know, and I, I definitely, I have a good time. But you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to set up the future too. So I make sure that I work just as hard to kind of um, set up future opportunities because I don't, I don't want this to be. You know, the show has blown up, but I, I, I try to stay blind to the hype of everything and just 
making it about the work right now. Okay. I'm really enjoying that. Uh, okay, so Vampire but Diaries. Yes, yeah, yeah, making it about, <laughs> making about the work. <laughs> <laughs> but my number Marcia is. Lee yes. <laughs> Ladies, bring yeah. it on. <laughs> so uh, Vampire Diaries, this whole vampire obsession people yeah. are so into this were you a vampire fan before you got on that show oh uh, no not not so much like I, I i respect it and i i enjoy you know the the mythology behind vampires but i'm more of a fan of the the gary Ullman's, you know dracula or um, Die still done you know i think is a fun one i i um the new wave kind of adds a level of romance which i think is very enjoyable it's just not my my type of movie. okay Okay, so you're not a True Blood fan, or uh, I mean, I, I I think again, all the actors are very great on it, and it's they they paint a picture very well. Um, Fair it's enough. Just okay. not, I'm more of a Sons of Anarchy kind okay. of fan. Yeah. <laughs> so now that you've had some time in Hollywood, you're how old? Uh, twenty two. Twenty two. So you're just oh, you are fresh. You've got a whole <laughs> career left in you. Gosh, I envy you. I, I hope so. Okay, so have you? Met some celebrities that you've been starstruck by, or worked um, with people. Uh, yeah, I've worked with a lot of people that you know. I, I've, I've been very lucky in that uh, regard. I've got to work with James Gandolfini, Lou Gossett Jr., Joe Montana. Uh, Jerry Tell me Fano, about G- Richard Dreyfuss. Cool. Uh, Did James Gandolfini is he like Tony Soprano, or is uh, it? He's a very you know. I learned a lot from him. He's he's um, he's a very admirable actor. You know, he's a very intimidating force. Um, and, but adds a level of sincerity to fear. That's it's just uh, an interesting, interest, interesting talent, and and he's able to tell a story really well. So, it but was, he's um, intense. Oh yeah, yeah. He takes the work very serious. Sounds um, like it. But to you know have the level of work that he has had and stuff, you have to you have to put that game face on. And it's it. I respect him very much, and I I've, I feel like I learn a lot through watching him. Well, that's very cool. And yeah. Elizabeth Shue is in the movie. Oh yeah, Piranha yeah, Three D. Love, Elizabeth love Shue, her. She's, she's just in a cool. And she worked with my dad back in the day in, on uh, Karate Kid. Uh, and uh, she just had you know dirt on my dad, and my dad had dirt on her, and it just gave me great stories. And she's just all around a good-hearted person. Well, I was reading an interview with her recently, as far as you know, why she would be in this campy thriller, and here yeah. she's an Oscar-nominated actress, yeah. and she just seems to have a really good sense of humor and a good perspective yeah, I mean, on that, it. That was the best thing. I mean, we had Richard Dreyfuss, Ving Rhames, like all these people. You, I mean, you hear the title, and you're just like I, uh, Piranha Three D. <laughs> <laughs> but you know. It, the, between the director and, and the actors they had on it, and just embracing the old fashioned scary movies where you know you go and you laugh and you, you're scared at certain points, and it has this basis of a, a family. It's just all around a fun movie. I mean, definitely not for the kids, but you know, um, if you know you go out to see a movie with your buddies, it's definitely the one to go see. Okay, now do you see fish now? Or like, if you would go to the Georgia Aquarium, are you a little concerned in the no, piranha no, aisle? No, I, I, I was always scared of sharks. Like after I saw Jaws for the first time, I wouldn't sit on the toilet for a little bit. But you know, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I surf. Uh, uh, I no, I, I I'm not gonna let anything scare me away from the water. Okay, I'm at a like linear like every other day. Oh, that's great. Yeah. That's great. So, but what if you're are you scared of of just schools of ladies screaming your name and throwing panties at you? Terrified. <laughs> 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 Stephen McQueen, it is so nice to meet you. The movie's Piranha 3D. You are just lovelier than ever. Uh, Wish you great success. Thank you very much. Yeah, you know what I like about you is I can tell. That you're very serious about the acting. Yes, yes. It's I not- mean, though, yeah, I mean, I, and you know, and from it, there's Oscar buzz about Piranha 3D. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? We will endorse that wholeheartedly. <laughs> nice right. to meet you. All right, cool.